Everybody go tag Megan and tag Blue and say we think y'all a good couple because that's just what it's gonna be. Megan the Stallion reacts to Carlisa forcing her to date Blueface. Megan the Stallion and Nicki Minaj have been steering the pot, but it seems like someone wants to add some extra spice to the mix. Who exactly? Carlisa, who recently came out claiming that Megan is the perfect match for her son, Blueface. That's why I want him to be with my daughter-in-law, Megan the Stallion. I'm already manifesting mm, okay. it. But hold up. Megan Megan isn't exactly thrilled about this. According to sources close to Megan, she reportedly believes Carlisa is just using her name for cloud chasing. And let's be real, that's not too far-fetched. But how did this drama even begin? What exactly did Carlisa say? Well, Carlisa spilled the tea in a candid confession captured by a TMZ reporter outside Men's Central Jail in LA, where Blueface is currently serving his sentence. Carlisa claimed that Megan would be a better fit for her son compared to other women he's been with, specifically mentioning Krishan. I feel like they need to, they're so young, they need to try to kind of grow a little bit and stop leaning on my son so much. That's why I want him to be with my daughter-in-law, Megan the Stallion. She even went on to talk about Megan and Blueface's future, envisioning a romantic journey through Europe. Talk about optimism. Carlisa even hinted at the possibility of Megan making an appearance on their family reality TV show, Sistock's LA Real Family Blues. She had a lot to say, that's for sure, but this isn't the first time that Carlisa has expressed her desire for Megan the Stallion and blue face to be a night em. He's already got her stuff together, her head's in the right place. You know, they're both Aquariuses, and I just kind of feel like that, that that energy of not having to take care of somebody all the time could let him be himself. Last year, she hopped on Instagram to suggest that Blueface should have a baby with Megan, claiming that she's not too good for her son. She even brought up Megan's shooting incident, but clarified that Blueface wouldn't shoot her in the foot, just somewhere else. She said, Megan and Blueface need to make a baby. Yes, I don't know why y'all was trying to act like she's too good for my son. The bee just got shot in her foot now, come on. Stop playing with me now, my son ain't about to shoot her in no foot he might shoot her in the backside but he ain't gonna shoot her in the foot she added don't try to play my baby like megan too good for my son and they could actually just like you know go to europe and try oh to my, so yeah, you, so you, so you want <laughs> megan the stallion with blue megan, face where are you <laughs> that's what you really oh and as if that was enough, Blueface himself jumped on the Jason Lee podcast and claimed that he and Megan had oral intimacy. Yep, you heard that right. Jason Lee at first brought up a question about Blueface's mother, Carlisa Saffold, saying that she wanted to set up Megan the Stallion with her son. He questioned, what did you think about his mom wanting to hook him up with Megan the Stallion? Blueface then blurted out, been there, done that, which seemed to take Jason by surprise in response asking, are you saying you slept with Megan the Stallion? To which Blueface replied, Been there and done what? Exactly. Next question. <laughs> you slept with Megan? Jason, I didn't say that. Look at me. Are you saying you slept with Megan the Stallion? I didn't say that. However, he then hinted that he might have got some head, which he quickly brushes off, saying that it was a long time ago. To add to the controversy, even Adam22 validated this jaw-dropping revelation as he posted a picture of himself and captioned it, me when Blueface told me Megan gave him top a few days after Tori shot her in the foot. And now, it appears that Carlisa is still trying to create some sparks, but I must say, I may not be the sharpest tool in the shed but even i can see that something is not quite right here mm -hmm. and i said it and then he came out and said that i guess they had had a situation before i never mm. knew that people just assumed that i knew that and i think that maybe they had it prematurely 
but they definitely need to rekindle that. It is like trying to fit a square peg into a round hole if you catch my drift. And don't get me wrong, I understand that every mother wants the absolute best for her precious son, but let's be real. Blue face is about as far from ideal as you can get. We're talking about a guy who's got a knack for being abusive, insensitive, and a serial cheater to top it all off. Yikes. I mean, seriously, who in their right mind would want to sign up for that? And let us not forget Get about his baby mama's folks. They've all had their fair share of drama with this guy. It is like a never-ending roller coaster ride of chaos. That's crazy. But back then, I could see it. I could see it. So I kind of believe that they probably did mess around. Just imagine Megan Thee Stallion getting tangled up with Blueface. It is like watching a train wreck in slow motion and who would want to see her heart and career go up in smoke because all of the controversies that seem to follow this guy around like a bad smell. If you ask me, instead of crying to Megan Thee Stallion to date her son, Carlisa should focus on fixing his character and reputation. I mean, they're like a broken record but not the good kind. I I understand it is time for some serious damage control but we can't just sweep all this under the rag and hope for the best i mean it's not that i don't want him with them i, I just feel like the energy that they bring i feel like they need someone else Jaden has moved on she's got a new girlfriend she's trying new things Anywho, it appears nothing is going to stop Carlisa because she's pulling all the stabs. Not only did she reach out to Megan for help, but she also called upon the one and only Kim Kardashian writing, Can you help me get my boy out and go on house arrest? Now, you might be scratching your head wondering how Kim got involved in all of this. Well, let me tell you, Kim Kardashian recently claimed to have graduated from law school and has been working on some serious cases. The case of Kevin Keith is deeply twisted and incredibly heartbreaking from all sides. An Ohio man has been sentenced to death. It sounds straightforward at first. Three so Carlisa probably thought she'd be, be the perfect ally in her battle, but she didn't just stop at making pleas. Oh no. She even took it a step further and asked for her son to be put on house arrest instead of being left off the hook. As if that wasn't enough, Carlisa just didn't rely on her own words to make her case. She shared a DM she received from a fan who argued that Javon wouldn't be able to see his son because Jaden wouldn't allow it now that Krishon is living with him and what was Carlisa's response she claimed that the judge could simply put Javo in his son's room and here's where things got interesting many people believe that Carlisa's response was some serious shade towards Krishan and honestly can you blame them Carlisa has been adamant about cutting all ties with her son so it is not surprising that she would throw a little shade her way and deniably it appears fans have had enough of the drama the feuds and the attention seeking and antics. They're waving their hands in the air, shouting enough is enough. And with that, we want to know what you think about Carlisa's comments about Megan and Blueface. Do you think Megan had a right to be upset about being used for cloud chasing? Do you believe Carlisa is cloud chasing? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and as always, stay tuned for more entertainment news and updates.